Research Design Lab. Hello everyone. This video will be a demonstration on how to use the LCD keypad sheet from researchdesignlab.com. This sheet can display 16 class 2 characters on the LCD. A single analog pin is multiplexed to read 5 input keys. It has an optional PWM based backlight control. This shield is stackable on any Arduino Uno or other clone boards like Freedino. As you can see, the shield is easily stackable on Arduino Uno R3. But just make sure that you are mounting it properly on the board. Now, let me just mount it on RDL Uno Atmega 328. RDL Uno Atmega 328 is also like a clone board like the Freedino. And as you can see, the shield goes fine on this board as well. Now, let me demonstrate the working of this board. Open the product page. In the product page, you can find an Arduino code. Copy this code. Paste it in Arduino software. Compile the code to check for any errors. Once the code has been compiled, Connect your Arduino to the system. Select the appropriate COM port. And just upload the code. Once you are done uploading the code, remove the USB connection of the port. Mount the shield on it. And then you can power on. You can observe the output here. Whenever I press the up key, the up key gets displayed on the screen. Same goes for the other keys. Now let me demonstrate the same on a clone board like RDL Uno at Mega 328. Connect the RDL Uno at Mega 328 to the PC. Upload the code by selecting the appropriate COM port. Once the code has been uploaded, disconnect the power supply for the board. And mount your shield on this. This shield uses minimum number of IOs that is 4 bits for LCD data and 2 control signals for the same. A single analog pin that is pin A0 is multiplexed to read 5 input key switches. Each key has been pulled up to a different voltage level. So different voltage will be generated every time a user selects a key. Hence saves the number of input output pin. The backlight of the LCD could be controlled by setting PWM to pin D10 by adding a few lines of code. Thank you for watching. Visit us at www.researchdesignlab.com.